on board your board. Let's get this over with. <laughs> well, look who's here. New recruits. Well, <laughs> let's fuck some shit up. Uh, are you sure we should help these guys? They seem kind of suspicious. It's no big deal. All we had to do was take them to Whiskey Peak, and that's pretty much it. So, hmm. who knows? Maybe we'll they'll reward us or something. I stole their log post. I, true. <laughs> that is very much true. You did do that. Well, they're letting, letting us keep it. Something feels off. Very off. I can't put my finger on it. Well, you might just be a little bit paranoid. Did you think about that, Nami? Trust my gut feelings, woman. <laughs> Whatever. I'm just saying you might be a little paranoid. Who knows, there might be something worse. Liberating. <sighs> yeah, that's the cat burglar Nami for you. Thank you. As soon as they get there, and the whole, those who've seen the actual anime, the whole warm welcome when it comes to pirates. <laughs> oh yeah, something's definitely wrong here. Well, no shit. Just play along. Then the eating and drinking begin. Izuku pretty much eating almost everyone under the table except for Luffy they're pretty much tied but it's the drinking as soon as he takes a sip he's like hey. okay that's is there something wrong <coughs> No, no, of course not. Huh. I just never tasted any like this. It tastes kind of different. Well, uh, you know, not all alcohol is the same. <laughs> yeah. I guess not. Him continuing to drink, but he's watching, he's counting. He's okay. Just play along, huh? Him starting to slowly feel it, so as soon as he's Yep, <clears throat> I'm trying to drug us. Might as well take a dive. Him passing out. And yeah, it goes similar to how it would in Canada with Zoro pretty much being Yeah. <clears throat> Already took a nap beforehand, so I'm good already. Nami, being her good old cat burglar self, Izuku actually walking outside just to see. Huh. So you were faking it too, huh, Zoro? Yeah. Always wondered uh, what the deal would be. Especially considering. Uh, their warm reception of us. Yes. Wait, you, you, you weren't. Of course not. Who thought Lana you were trying to drug us? Psh, I had to take a dive. Kind of. I'm not gonna lie. It hurt my pride a little bit. <laughs> Wait, what? Oh yeah, letting Zoro and Nami drink me under the table. No, that hurts my pride. Do you have any idea how how messed up that that is for me? Uh, you're serious? That is a heart attack. Heck, I wouldn't want anyone to drink me on the table unless they actually earned it. But then again, I did eat a lot, and 
I did type with Luffy. Wait. You look familiar. Hmm? Uh, you're that rogue marine! Oh. Oh. Am I? Wait, how do you know me? Well, a Roman Marine with a promising future who was trained by Garb? <laughs> What's wrong with you? You don't know Garb, do you? Oh, oh yeah, I know him. So what? I trained with him. So did Luffy. Ah. You serious? Yep. How are you two still alive? Luck. God was on our side. But if anything, I trained with him longer than Luffy. Really? Yeah, and I got the scars to prove it, believe me. Huh, I have a whole new respect for you. That's very nice of you to just say. As they're pretty much like... <laughs> huh? What? How the hell do you want? Uh, did you forget? Well, we have you hostage. Oh, wait. You do? Yes! Go on! Be... Just be a little scared. Why should we? You guys are weaklings compared to us. Ah. Yeah, I said it. Sora, would you love to personally be the relevant crapper out of them? Wait, his name is Zoro? As in Roro? No, yeah. The pirate hunter? Uh huh. Uh. There's no way that rubber band man is the captain. Hmm. Well, technically, he's co captain. What? Yeah. Izuku here is our second captain. That's not how captains work. Unless he's the first mate. <sniffs> no, I'm the co-captain. After that boat's mine. Uh, that's not how crews work. Well, it's how ours work. And they're just working out pretty well. Them just opening fire because they're sick of their bullshit. Yuzuku just... Okay. All right, Zoro. Heads or tails? Huh? Yeah. Depending on which lands on which depends on whether we're gonna kill them or just render them unconscious. All right. Heads we kill them. Tails unconscious. All right. Let's do it. Uh. Huh. Well, everyone just, what, wait, what, 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 what happened? Tails, you get to live. Very overconfident, don't you think? No. As they just disappear in a flash and they're like, where the hell do they go? Just then, 20 of them just fall. It's that easy. <laughs> as soon as the bullets start flying, it's pretty much... Like, they must be dull fruit users. Is you No, know, this is just our skills. Plus, I am half mink, so... <laughs> what? Oh, yes. You, you, you guys never stood a chance against us. 
<laughs> if anything, it's kind of sad. As this is a big woman <laughs> just grabs hold of his skull. I've never met anyone who can match my physical strength. Not one man. Like, <sighs> It would have been so. I I am not gonna lie. If we were enemies, I'd probably ask you out on a date. Wait, what? Why aren't you screaming in pain? Izuku just grabs hold of her skull. He's like, "Oh, do you mean like this?" Her yelling, her begging him to let go of her head, and Izuku's. This is how you crush a one skull. <coughs> huh? What? We're not supposed to kill them. Uh, oh, oh, right. Hold on, just let me... Him applying more pressure until she just passes out through shock. Again. There is no words. That may not be right, correct number, but I don't give a damn. So, you can imagine it was crazy easy for Zoro and Ken to pretty much get rid of them all. But Izuku, who's not only had more training with Garp, he's also half mink, a lion mink. So. Yeah, it is complete and total bullshittery of nonsensical awesomenessity. That's right. I, I'm pretty sure some of you miss my bullshittery, especially when it comes to making up words. However, when those others show up, Izuku is pretty much. Hmm. So, let me get this straight. You two are stronger than the rest of these guys? That is correct. Alright. Hmm. Okay, we'll fight you. Uh, what? Yeah. <laughs> really, I've been a little bit bored, so. Eh. I still got some more energy to burn. You, you, you can't be serious. Oh no, I am. Please don't disappoint me. I. Ugh. I really need the workout. Zoro's a good guy, so who you want? Uh, the dude looks like he. He may be a little peeved off, maybe someone pissed in his coffee or something. So I guess I'll t take the woman. She may have more of a level head to fight. As soon as it begins, Izuku was. <sighs> I already regret this. Her laughing. Her is like, yes, it's too late for you. To beg for your life now is as soon as she falls, she's laughing, but it slowly starts to fade away. As soon as she realizes Izuku's still standing and he's holding her. Uh, wh what? Ugh, seriously, you call this heavy? In which, on one hand, she's, it's flattering. On the other hand, it's also terrifying. Like, so this, this does not affect you. Nope. Compared to what Garp had me do, this is nothing. You are lighter than a feather. As he starts slamming her over and over and over again. Her not really in that much hurt, but uh, it hurts. Zoro, he's already sliced. With the other guy, him unconscious. So, pushing that difficult. So, 
Yeah. If anything, it was kind of sad, man. I, I'm not gonna lie. Hmm. But if anything, I feel like I've heard of some of these guys before. Hmm. Ah! Broke works. Oh, so you finally figured it out. Oh, yeah, the bounty hunters, pirates, and whatnot. Wait, they're pirates? Oh, yeah, this whole criminal organization thing, you know. Eh, no real big deal and whatnot. Them just walking off. As, yeah, Lady Valentine is number five. They're famous. Okay, let's not, let's not deal with them anymore. Let's just get back to the whole matter at hand, which is Princess Vivi. Zuku hearing this, like, a what? <clears throat> Princess, what, are you talking about from Alabasta? Who? Shut uh, On one hand, they tried to rob us, kill us, and whatnot. On the other hand, hmm. What? What are you talking about, man? Like, oh well, so I can go not to intervene. Is this who's showing up again? In which? Yeah. Hey, Valentine's. We give up. What? No, we give up. Oh, come on, it's just one of them. Yeah, but he he, got, he defeated me crazy easily. My devil fruit power was nothing compared to him. He's that strong. Yes! Uh, I, I don't know. We, we could face some real repercussions if we fail. He... <clears throat> I'd rather live. Do you think the boss is going to let us live if we fail? Ugh. He's like, uh, y'all can give up if you want. I'll beat the ever-loving crap out of you. If you don't give up. So it's really up to you. Like, don't underestimate us. Oh, no, I'm not underestimating you. I'm just trying to warn you. These hands are rated E for everybody. As you can see from the mounds of unconscious bodies, we allow these fuckers to live. And I'm extending that invitation of life to you. What are we? I don't know if we. It's your choice. I'll give you three seconds. Wait, 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 what are you talking about? Three. Him just bodying them. Uh, I, I, did you just. Indeed. Yes, I, I, am an, I am very good at what I do, and being a bad at people is something I take great pride in. So, back to the matter at hand. You are Princess Vivi from Alabaster. Uh, uh, yes. Let's have a little chat. As yes, very much. So. Oh, let me think. Uh, Warlord. Oh, you mean Crocodile? You know who? Yeah, of course. Seriously, so you said Alabaster, or you said Warlord, it was pretty obvious who you meant. Apparently, he's a devil fruit user, too, so. Oof. Not someone you want to, you know, fight um, prepared. <laughs> what? So you know? Oh, yeah, I, I know. I know, Crocodile. He, he's not someone you really want to piss off. Yeah. Well, good luck to you. 
I am out of here. Wait, what? Yeah, I'm leaving. Well, we're leaving. Wait, 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 wait. What? Can you help us?